Hey y'all, I am Luna Ray, the Gorgeous Oracle, and I'm here to do your mid-January read. This is for Aries, your sun moon, sun, moon, rising, and Venus signs, or if you cross-watching for a Aries. Before I get into the reading, can you please like, share, and subscribe to my channel? Can you follow me on Instagram at I am underscore Justina Nicole? Everything will be down in the description box below this video. So, Aries, what I have for you, I have I have the Three of Wands, I have the Nine of Pentacles, I have the Two of Swords, and I have the Three of Pentacles. Um, I have two threes out here. Somebody could be 33. Mm. Yeah, somebody could be 33. Um, but anyways, Aries, whatever you're doing, you could be collaborating with people, um, working with people, partnerships. It's some type of collaboration you, you're doing. Um, whatever you're doing with other people, I feel like it's bringing you success. It's bringing you some type of abundance. I feel like you're happy. These people that you're working with, I feel like these people, um, they could be your business partners or something. Some type of organization, a business collaboration, something that you're, um, something that you're involved with, with other people. I feel like these people actually helped you get to this level of success or something. I feel like you're good right now. Are you feeling confident within something? I feel like in your career life, some type of business, some type of collaboration, you're doing good and it's it's fruitful. It's some type of abundance here. I feel like you needed these people to help you get to the next level. So now you have some type of confidence within yourself to come forward. I feel like you want to come forward to somebody despite of what other people may say or think. You want to impress somebody, but you needed help from people or you needed help before you come forward to impress someone yeah i feel like you want to impress somebody you have your eyes on somebody and before you come forward you want to make sure you got everything together everything in order for you to come forward i heard friendly i feel like you're going to start off real friendly with a person that you actually have a crush on or a person that you actually like or a person that you actually see yourself being with for the long term. But I feel like before you even offer that, you're going to come in being friendly. You could be having people in your ear telling you, like, this is a bad idea or leave that situation alone, leave that person alone. But I feel like you're not going to listen. I heard mind over heart over mind. You're like listening to your heart or something. It's like your heart is leading you to this person. I feel like you really want to be with somebody. But you just have to make sure you had your shit together first. Yeah, I have the chariot. And I have the star. In reverse. Oh, excuse me. Aries, you could have been with somebody. Because I had the star card in reverse. I feel like you're realizing like this person that you're with is not suitable for you or this person that you're with is 
someone that you're with, you're realizing like this person um don't do it for you or y'all not compatible or this person is not your type. I feel like you're going to leave this person on a relation on a relationship level you're going to leave this person but yeah you're still going to work with this person so you i feel like you like actually working with this person but you don't like being in a relationship with this person or whoever this is somebody is not who they say they are or you're realizing like this person is not your type. This person is not what you thought they were. Aries. Um... Somebody could be plotting on how to steal from you. Somebody could be stealing money from you, Aries, or Aries, this is you. Somebody was doing good, or you seen somebody was... I just heard, like, financially abundant... I heard lick. I feel like you hit a lick on somebody. Another message I'm getting, this is why you can't be with this person. Because of what you did to them behind their back. It's like you're telling yourself, it's no way in hell that I can be with this person because... I don't have no respect for this person. This person can't be my girlfriend or boyfriend. This person damn sure can't have my last name. I feel like you did a whole bunch of stuff. Aries or Aries, this is you. Or someone in regards to you. Somebody did something. Okay, this is the team. Aries, um, this is, this not going to resonate for everybody. Aries, this could be someone in regards to you, or I mean, this could be you. I feel like somebody was happy on, um, somebody ended up, How can I put it? I'm trying to see how can I put it into words. Somebody came across some money or something. Something fruitful, right? And I feel like this person was happy about it. And this is supposed to be some type of relationship. Whoever was happy about this like new profound success or money or abundance or something. I feel like somebody called their so-called boyfriend or girlfriend to, like, give them the news. To, like, let them know, like, hey, this happened. I'm so happy I got this or I got that. And the whole time you're expressing to your mate, to somebody you feel like had good, your best interests. The whole time somebody was, like... Like robbing you, robbing you, stealing from you or something. And it's like they, they became abundant or somebody became, I ain't going to say wealthy, but somebody ended up getting their money together because somebody ran their mouth or somebody was telling them like, I got this, I got that. I'm so happy. Um, I'm God bless me. Look at all these miracles happen, happening to me. And the whole time they thinking like, 
their boyfriend or girlfriend is happy for them or they feel like, okay, it's, since this is my girlfriend or boyfriend, I should be able to express my feelings, right? And the whole time, somebody was just taking mental note of everything that somebody got and they was just stealing from this person, like taking from this person. Somebody have access to like bank accounts or documents. It's something personal that another person has access to. I heard don't even know. Somebody don't even know that this person has access to their personal belongings or personal documents, social security numbers, and all types of stuff going on here. Somebody has access to that. Another message I'm getting, somebody could have been opening up, um, like, credit cards, bank accounts. Somebody could have been doing all types of fraud under somebody else's identity. If somebody don't have nothing, they don't have no clue like this is going on behind their back. Or credit. Somebody could have like good credit. Somebody could have called their girlfriend or boyfriend. Like, babe, I just, oh my God, I'm so happy my credit score is like 750. And somebody could have been like, okay, um... Put me on as an authorized user. Or somebody could have put themselves at, as an authorized user and somebody don't have no idea this is going on like right under their nose. It's some shit like that going on. I actually feel sorry for this person. But anyways, this is why somebody or these people could have been doing like fraud and stuff together. Because I do have partnerships and collaboration. Somebody could have been doing fraud and like stuff together. But these people could, like when they was doing this fraud, the agreement was like, I take 50 50, we're going to split it down the middle. But really and truly, somebody is taking like, 60 or 70 percent while the other person is getting 30 or maybe 40 percent of the profit but yes yeah, somebody will say like whatever these people these people are doing fraud right and somebody will say like well i made ten thousand so the other person, the girlfriend or boyfriend, whoever is in cahoots or involved with this, they like, all right, I get five, you get five. But really and truly, somebody could have made like 15000 <laughs> And they could have gave the person five 5000 while they pocket 10000 Or really and truly, they didn't make like twelve or 13000 and they, they only gave somebody like 5500 It's some shit going on like that. Oh, Aries. Yeah, it has something. Look, Six of Pentacles, the Knight of Wands, and the Two of Swords. Yeah, it has something to do with money. Somebody got with the person, got with somebody for all the wrong reasons. Somebody was like an easy target. Somebody is like. Um, I'm not going to say dumb. Somebody could be like dingy. Like la 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 la. It's like they give me. <laughs> this person gives me that vibe. Or somebody's not in tune with reality. Somebody acts like a little girl. Or they have like a mind of a child. Or well, somebody acts like a little boy and they have a mind of a little boy, of a kid. And they just go through life like la 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 la. And they don't see like what's really going on. Or they don't, they don't, 
they not whoever this is is not in touch with reality at all and the reality is somebody was like just stealing from them doing all types of stuff from them somebody not even realizing the shit i feel like somebody wasn't realizing it because somebody likes one person way more than the other person likes them so somebody played on that or played on their emotions or used that against this person somebody don't it's like they since they like aries more than aries like this person this was like a quick lick or a good lick as in, this was like an easy target, an easy come up because this person likes me way more than I like them. This person, somebody likes being around the other person. So, it's like somebody is using that to their advantage. Like, if I just include this person into, like, all my plans, or if I just bring this person around, like, all my family and friends... It's like this is what this person wants. Like th this person don't care about nothing else but just to be around or just to feel included. Somebody is playing playing on somebody else's emotions. Somebody could actually have um like abandonment issues or somebody could actually have issues with feeling wanted or um issues with just being a part of something so aries i mean if this is you or someone in regards to you somebody knows this about the other person so somebody told this person like yeah we're a couple yeah we girlfriend and boyfriend yeah 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 it's like somebody just say yes or agrees to everything just so this person won't say anything or this person always like inviting whoever is dingy and like just being around. It's like that's all they care about is to just be around, just to be included. So as long as this person is around, another person is able to like get what they want. Somebody is greedy because on top of this person being around, this person is happy. So they're willing to do any and everything to stay included or to stay around. So not only this person already like breaking bread and doing for Aries or Aries, this is you. Somebody is already like doing for a, a one person, but they just don't know that even behind this person's back, you still doing for this person. Hopefully that makes sense, but it, it's some fuck shit going on and I feel sorry for, I feel sorry for this person. I really do. Somebody don't even know what's happening to them. Somebody don't even know that they was actually a part of like helping somebody build this person up or help this person get to where they need to be in life. So this person can actually, it's like now this person can manifest being with somebody that they really want to be with. Somebody time has came or their time is about to come for this to be over this is about to be over because somebody somebody oh lord Somebody could be on drugs too. Somebody could be on drugs and alcohol. Another message I'm doing, it, this is weird. Somebody could have been doing um 
magic or spell work. This is okay. This is so weird. And this is backwards. Somebody has been doing like magic or like some type of spell work or praying. Somebody could have been praying to keep Aries in their life. It's this dingy person. Somebody is like praying to still have Aries a part of their life. Or somebody is praying like, Lord, this is my husband. Um, I know he's going to marry me. Jesus, please let this, this man marry me. I have the most time of my life when I'm with this person. I have never felt this way before. This is my soulmate. This is this is who I'm supposed to be with. Please, God, you know, I don't want to be with no other man besides this one. It's like somebody or a woman, somebody is, but what's weird to me is that somebody is actually praying for somebody to continue to take advantage of them. That's pretty much what the fuck this is. Like, <laughs> I'm not trying to laugh or nothing because it's not funny. But it's like, this. From, even from the energy I'm picking up from this, these cards, somebody don't even treat the other person right. Or somebody... It's like... Somebody don't even invest in the other person, no nothing. The person that's getting the short end of the stick and has always got the short end of the stick. It's like they praying to God, they praying to universe to still keep getting the short end of the stick because they want this person to stay in their life. Like that's 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 wild as fuck to me, okay. Look, I have the Hierophant, I have the Hangman, and I have the Three of Pentacles. Bro. Somebody. Oh, this reading is deep. Um, Aries. Somebody knows the truth. The other person... Is refusing to see the truth, right? Um, the truth is that somebody purposely got with somebody else because they knew they needed this person help. I heard expertise. Somebody could be like experienced in something. And they knew like they needed this person's help. When it comes to like love and relationships, somebody get like so lost and caught up with this with this ideal of what they think love is, right? But I feel like when it comes to business and finances, this person is good. With money and business saving and stuff. But when it comes to love, somebody always get taken advantage of or somebody always get caught up in the moment to where they don't they not in touch with reality. I heard this person not even in touch with themselves. Somebody is like a lost person. Somebody is really lost. I have one, two, three, four. I have four major, hold on, one, two, no, hold on. One, two, three, four, five. I have five major arcanas out here. Um, one person is changing and the other person is not. Um, this person that's in La La Land and think like everything is a game or think everything is a joke or something, this person is about to get left. Or this it's going to be revealed that somebody really didn't want them or somebody don't look at them 
in like a relationship type way. Somebody actually look at them as a friend. Like that's just my friend. That's just my homegirl. That's just my homeboy. Somebody is good at what they do when it comes to money, when it comes to scamming, fraud, or some. Somebody is good at that, but somebody, when it comes to love and relationships, somebody needs to work on themselves, right? And this is what this person is missing. Somebody don't want to work on themselves. But anywho, Aries, this could be you. This definitely ain't the dingy person. I feel like somebody, because I have the higher fun and I have the hangman and I have the three of pentacles. Aries, I feel like it's been, I heard divinely guided. It's been divinely guided for you to see this situation for what it is too this is the tea both people were in um like this fantasy i heard fantasy island like somebody <laughs> these people i feel like it's a couple this couple got with each other based on the ideal of of something the ideal of love or in the beginning Aries could have actually thought this person could have been the one for them but the reason why they feel like this person was the one for them because they were providing for this person that's the only reason why nothing else I heard shallow these people are shallow materialistic or something somebody was just so concerned about like their image and material like material wealth or something so when this person came in and was able to provide that for aries or aries this is you you feel like this person was the one and then the dingy person by this person Always like coming around the family, friends, and always like was included in the plans. Somebody was like, this is the one. He's the one. She's the one. Because they always want to include me. They always want me around. I am special. But the, the T is, the reason why they was always bringing you around. Because they... Because they knew that was your weakness. And they knew by you always being around, their spot was secured. Like, by you, Aries, by you always having this person around, you knew that this person, it was impossible for this person to, like, um start giving money or start you know helping out someone else because you always had this person around it was like you was closely watching this person monitoring this person just so they won't give money to other people and You was like just making sure like it's you. You had this person number one spot. I get all the money. If I can get all this person's money, then this person can get all my attention. But this attention was a was an illusion though. This person thought this attention was because, you know, we're really in a relationship. This is my boyfriend. This is my girlfriend. We love each other. That's why we always, that's why we're inseparable. That's why we always together. But really, they was always together just to make sure to keep your keep their eye on your money, just to know what you're doing, just to know that you're not giving to nobody else. Somebody know. By them keeping you closer. I heard keep your friends close and your enemies closer. 
<sighs> this is sad because really and truly, this person, keep your friends close and your enemies close. So this, per this person you thought that was your boyfriend or girlfriend, this is actually your enemy. And somebody that just wanted to take everything from you. Everything you made or somebody just wanted to be in control of your life, your moves. Somebody wants to just be in control of making sure you're doing what they tell you to do. Making sure you're at where you're supposed to be at. Keeping tabs on you. But they're not keeping tabs on you because they love you. they keeping tabs on your money. Or like whatever you do, whatever. It, it, it's weird, okay? But anyways, somebody want to be with somebody else. Um, Aries. Because I have the higher fund, the hangman, and the three of pentacles. Somebody want to be with somebody else. Somebody got what they needed. From this dingy person. So it's like now I have the means. Or I have the money now. To be with whoever I want to be with. And this is some more tea. The tea is that. Spirit. Actually supports. Aries. Or Aries, this is a person in regards to you. Spirit actually supports this person leaving this dingy person to be with somebody else. That's the real team. And the reason why Spirit supports this because somebody... I ain't gonna say somebody deserved to get done the way that they did. But I feel like it was clear, it was obvious that somebody didn't have good intentions for the other person. So, this was somebody karma. Like, this could have been, um, I heard past life karma or um, like some type of karmic debt. This could have been some type of karmic debt. And this situation, I feel like this situation is coming to an end. I don't have the death card out here, but all these major arcana, it's a whole bunch of transformation going on. Um, by these people coming together, right? Uh, somebody was able to pay their karmic debt. Something happened. I'm getting like some uh, some past life. These people could have uh met each other in a past life and something could have happened between these people that Aries could have got done wrong by this person. In a, a previous lifetime. And it could have had something to do with money. Somebody could have got with the other person. In like a past life. And took all their money. So in this lifetime. Somebody has to like pay that karmic debt. And I feel like that's exactly what they did with the six of pentacles. This was some type of soul contract between these two people. These two people had to come together. Period. Point blank. These two people actually um was supposed to come together to like learn some type of lesson from this karmic debt. I feel like one person um one person learned the lesson. One person seeing this situation for what it is, like I got with somebody that I really didn't like or I really didn't find them attractive. Uh, I used them. I got what I needed. Somebody is hard-headed. Somebody just don't get it or don't understand or something. This is why... This had to happen to them for them to get it or to understand. But I low-key feel like this person still don't get it. 
Somebody feel like this is a game. Like this is life. This is real life. Somebody is going through life like a little girl or like a little boy or something. Somebody feel like this is a game. Another message I'm getting by somebody uh, taking money from the other person. Whenever they find out, whenever if this dingy person was to find out, they'll probably start laughing like, ha, 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 one of their other, uh, another little game, ha, ha, I'm going to get him back. <laughs> you know, and it's like, nah, this, I feel like somebody really came up off the other person, like straight up. But somebody feel like it's a game, like, oh, it's okay, I'm, I'm going to get him back, I'm going to get her back. It's nothing, ha, <laughs> ha, he funny. But now somebody really got got. Like straight up somebody got got. And I feel like this person had the opportunity to like put their foot down. And to like stop this, stop this person from like using them. But they didn't. Um, but that's all I have for this reading Aries. Thank you. Bye bye.